Hello everyone, this is Mr. Brass, and today I'll be going over my thoughts on the non sequitur show drama. Now, this isn't going to be academically rigorous like some of my other videos, but instead this will be more of a rant. Kyle Curtis, or as I call him, Cuntus, committed fraud against Steve McRae by pushing him off the channel, taking over the Patreon, Steam Labs, Teesprings, etc., and still hasn't paid Steve for his work as a 50% partner should be even though that was what they agreed on. If I may be allowed one gay joke in all of this, it looks like Steve got stabbed in the back by a gay guy. And as the biblical history skeptic has pointed out, Kyle is also a plagiarist to boot when it comes to music, so that just sort of adds insult to injury. What makes it worse is that you have those two morons, Caitlin Chloe and Godless Engineer, saying Steve committed fraud and are trying to say that he gets SSI and other government funds, even though all he really gets is VA, but that's for his time served in the military and it isn't based on his income at all. And from the info I've gathered, Steve hasn't used it in years. Let's get real, Godless Engineer is a shit debater who has lost to young earth creationists and flat earthers. And all his arguments basically come down to him yelling while his dumb as a doornail girl cheers him on. They are both theologically, historically, politically, legally, and culturally illiterate. Now, I've known KC and Kyle were SJWs for a while, as KC said I was sexist because I made rude comments at her, which doesn't make sense. Just because I call KC a bitch, that doesn't mean I believe all women are bitches. Kyle has basically said screw the English language in order to maintain that I'm racist because I happen to repeat back a racial slur so as to more effectively defend a black man. So Kyle being a fraud and KC and GE being morons doesn't surprise me but I do feel sorry for Steve as he wanted the money so his daughter could have something to fall back on. Boy, as I believe his name is, also got hurt here as well, as he wasn't paid for his work either, and he's a guy who could have really used the money. Ha has stolen money from men who were supposed to be his friends, and betrayed the trust of many people, and made promises that were never fulfilled. And this is why there are massive amounts of people massively downvoting his videos and unsubscribing, from the non sequitur show along with GE and KC. Ka has lost patrons on Patreon and so it looks like he screwed himself out of money as well. Now I think that's enough for now. I'm glad to have gotten to talk about this. I stand with Steve and this is Mr. Brass saying goodbye and get wise.